Former Workers' Party cadre Lo Peying thought XMP Raisa Khan was naive and could buckle under pressure like a Lao Hong biscuit. This emerged on October 18 during the cross-examination of Ms Lo on Day 5 of WP Chief Pritam Singh's trial. She was being questioned about the points she presented to the WP disciplinary panel that was convened to look into Ms Khan's lying controversy. Lao Hong is a Hokkien phrase that literally means leak air. Ms Lo said that in Singapore, Lao Hong sometimes means soft. By extension, it refers to someone who buckles quite easily under pressure. This is what she told the court. Ms Lo had also described Ms Khan as kind and compassionate in her October 17 testimony. Another former WP cadre, Mr Yudhishthra Nadan, took the stand as the prosecution's third witness. His testimony included explaining why he redacted this message from documents submitted to the Committee of Privileges. The message was sent in a three-person group chat with Ms Khan and Ms Lo, and her refers to the sexual assault victim mentioned in Ms Khan's lie. He said he redacted the message as he felt that it was immaterial to the committee's investigations. The same message had emerged during Ms Lo's October 17 testimony, when she admitted to lying about the reason for redacting Mr Nathan's message. Mr Nathan also testified that he was surprised by the formation of the WP disciplinary panel, as Singh had known early on about Ms Khan's lie and had allegedly told her he would not judge her for not clarifying it. He said that he was unsure whether the panel was just for show to assuage members of the public or whether the WP leaders were seriously going to investigate Ms Khan. Mr Nathan also said that the first time Ms Khan met the panel, Singh had told her that she needed to obtain the support of her fellow Singh Kang GRC MPs. When Mr Nathan learned about this, he said he found it quite problematic as he didn't understand why she needed to do so. He felt that the panel was a witch hunt to kick Ms Khan out of the party. The hearing will resume on October 21st, with the defence beginning the cross-examination of Mr Nathan.